Hello, my name is Talia Marisela España and welcome to my fashion journey. To start off, I'm going to get into the recent project that I'm working on from my Apparel Construction 1 class. We've learned all about the different types of seams, different types of stitches, um, how to work the industrial sewing machine. Um, we even learned how to make a collar, which I must say was a little bit challenging, but I did it and I got through it and it was successful. But now we're getting into actually making our first garment, which will be a white shirt. So we technically get to design this shirt. And what I mean by that is that we still have to get a star bought pattern, but you know, that's just so that we can create the shirt so that can be our base, but we get to design it ourselves. So we get to choose the embellishments we want. We get to choose the fabric that we want to use, the decoration, the style, you know, everything, the final look, we get to choose that. We get to make it what we envisioned for our design. So I already got my store-bought pattern and I'm ready to just get this thing started and I'm just going to put the ideas that I have in here onto paper and just bring it to life like that before I can bring it to life onto the actual shirt. So this is my final design right here. This is my final concept of how I'm going to make this pattern my own pattern. And this is it right here. I kind of based out based like the whole sketch on oops, I based the whole sketch kind of on this part. So I use that kind of as a guidance for my sketch of just the individual shirt. I want to use a transparent white fabric for the whole piece. I'm not sure what I'm going to use yet, but I, when I was looking at fabrics, I did see a transparent polyester. I don't remember exactly what it was called. And then in class, our teacher showed us how different types of fabrics, and one of us she showed us was organza. And she was trying to show us some that are a little bit more on the natural side, so organza was one, and um, that one was transparent. It was a little bit more sheer. And I really like that one, so I'm probably going to go try to find that or use the some form of transparent sheer fabric that I can find. And then on top of that, so these are going to be flowers all along here and then spread around kind of the body of the shirt. 
And then the sleeves I'm probably going to leave as is except for this part, which is, I'm trying to, I don't know, I guess, I'm trying to make like a leaves or something, but I want to just, I really wanted to emphasize the shoulder somehow. I'm still unsure about this part, but I'm, I don't know, we'll see if I leave them. But these are supposed to mimic like long leaves, kind of to go hand in hand with the flowers. And then this poof right here is the same. I'm just gonna leave it as right there, how it's shown right there. I kind of tried to go based off of this. So I'm probably gonna leave that and then put the leaves like right on top. And then the sleeves, when I was at the store looking at fabrics, and I'm sure a lot of you have seen, are probably familiar, I don't, <laughs> don't know what it's called, of course, but I saw another kind of sheer transparent fabric that had pearls on it, and I absolutely loved it. So that one had pearls on it, it was like the same concept that I have going on right here with the flowers spread over this transparent fabric, except it was with pearls. So I'm thinking I'm either going to get that fabric or put the pearls on myself. And then right here, right at the edge, um, I want to put the pearls to match those. For fun, I decided to add like a little choker made of which the idea is that this will be made of the same fabric from the shirt, from this part of the shirt, and then all the pearls right there would go in the middle to match this part. And that's my shirt. That's what I'm really hoping it's going to look like. We'll see. <laughs> um, I'm really excited to try to bring this idea to life. Um, it does seem like a little bit of a challenge, but it's one that I'm willing to take. So this, so basically I'm trying to do all of this with this pattern right here. 